Hello patrons and finally during the Christmas period or just after the Christmas period I have managed to well, find some drawings on uh, one of my earlier computers and uh, retrieve them plus uh, I've drawn up a lot uh, probably about 80% uh, new drawings to make this conversion kit to provide a conversion kit drawing set and um, you know all the bought items as well such as stepper motors and, and zero backlash bull screws and uh, everything else that was bought for this and I've put it into a package it's quite a lengthy package um, it's a lot more, I, su I suppose, complex than the MIDI CNC router build. Um, although, you know, it may not look it. <laughs> it is quite, uh, quite complex. Um, some of the geometry is, uh, you know, quite... Some of the geometry was difficult to uh, uh, sort of come by, but... Um, we got there and, uh, and I know a lot of you have been waiting for it um, and certainly a, a lot of people on the internet have been asking me uh, for uh, the drawings so it will be available for patrons uh, three axes and up um, so I will now explain to you the drawings uh, in some detail and uh, I will probably make uh, general videos for the general public uh, as well doing some explanation uh, as I'm using it. So um, we'll just go over to the mainframe computer over there and the big screen and uh, we'll get into it. Okay, so um, this is going to be, a, I suppose, an informal affair. So it's just me chatting to you guys. Um, so I'll start off by explaining, I suppose, around the world where you can still purchase uh, one of these, what I know as, a SIG X2. And uh, now there are several different forms uh, of this unit uh, and I'll run through a couple of them now. Um, so this particular one, now this is a genuine SIG okay, um, unit, it's the exact one that I have. Um, and this, you know, this is how it comes. It's got the 300 watt motor. It's it's adequate, you know. I mean, I suppose I could upgrade it to a 500 or an 800 watt, but um, it serves its purpose for me. You know, I've had it for probably 15 years, way 17 years actually. And um, I only started doing something about it when I allowed someone to come up the workshop here and uh, do a little five minute job when I was uh, away on business and they stripped the gears in it. <laughs> so that's how this upgrade came about. Um, I, I, you know, it sat around for years actually, probably five years and I didn't touch it. And uh, anyway, going on a bit now. So that's the, the, the general unit. SIG X2, uh, they put an L in it. Don't know what the L stands for, but this is the exact one that I converted. Now, this is in Australia and India and other places where SIG sell their tooling. The SIG is a Chinese company, but they're, they're huge. You know, they're one of the biggest in the in the business. And they sell a variety 
of these uh, types of mills uh, and lathes actually that's the same company SIG I did the um, the what is it 7 by 7.14, 7 by 20 inch lathe that I did the CNC lathe conversion on. Okay, so let's SIG again. Okay, so that's that one. Um, now, in the United States and Canada, uh, Grizzly sell them. This is the exact same one, okay, but it's sold under the title of Grizzly G8689 4 by 16 inch. That's the travel of the bed, okay. Um, so if you know if you're in anywhere in the Americas, I mean I, I suppose you could order one from South America, you know, sort of from. Uh, North America and definitely you could get one into Canada uh, and all over America via Grizzly and and in Europe um, specifically England Ackminster sells this model however this one is slightly upgraded uh, I think this is the high torque motor. Um, I think it's still 300 watts, but higher torque. Um, now, as far as I know, all the castings, okay, everything on on that is the same as mine. It's just a slightly newer version. And like I said, it has this uh, higher torque motor on it. That's uh, it's like a al extruded aluminium um, body, as opposed to a cast steel one. So um, they're still readily available throughout the world. I haven't checked in, you know, sort of the rest of Europe, like France or Germany, but I'm I'm sure you can get them freighted over there I'm sure there's a dealer for SIG so they're still available and they will be for some years yet 